dog. Finally come crawling home. Oh, it's you. How confusing. I might have a fever. Oh, the Hundred Knight! You're okay? <laughs> of course it's fine. It was just teleporting between worlds or something. As if I'd let that break it. Ah, oh, yes. 108 years and 30 days ago, Master Leah's teleportation spell fizzled, and she ended up in a cesspool. So many tears. Metallia! You can't get my name right, but you remember the most useless and unnecessary things! Anyway, Hundred Knight, did you learn anything? idea what you're trying to tell me. I know I told you to go exploring, but if you can't give me a report, it's kind of worthless. Then maybe we should have a collect something to bring back to you? That way, we might be able to learn more about the, uh, the other side. That might work out. Hundred nuts. Next time you return, something interesting. My apprentice to beat me to a solution. My head must not be working right today. I'm counting on you. I'm going to go to sleep for a bit. Wake me up if Bisco comes back. Hmm. As I thought, she might be a bit shocked that Bisco left her all of a sudden. But she has been alone all this time. So I do not believe she has that kind of sentimentality. Now then, Sir Hundred Knight, please resume your search. It is the crystallized 
form of a swamp's manor. A small and hardened swamp, essentially. With this in hand, you can wander outside of the swamp a ways, Leah. Really? Is that why I can be here and not feel sick? Not to lose this. Do you understand? If you lose it, I may not be able to make another one. Synthesizing it is incredibly difficult. If it is, then I'll make more. I'll make lots so I can always come and play, old hag. <laughs> one is plenty, really. But if you can make one, just don't let this crystal go. Do you understand me? Uh-huh. I get you. I'll take good care of it. Oh, I want to read a book. Can I read something, old hag? Yes, of course. Book. Can I read this one? Sure, but it's a difficult one for someone as young as you. Are you a fan of Urukalia? Yep. I want to be just like Urika. <laughs> I see, I see. Then read everything you can and become wiser and wiser. Help you get smarter. It's a tad bitter, but please do your best drinking it down. So if I take this medicine, I'll be more like Dorica? Don't worry about that. I believe you'll become an amazing great witch. Okay, I'll drink it then. Malia hasn't re 
returned yet. Where did she go off to? Is she messing around in that village again? I know. Mia, why don't we ask Blackie to go and see how Malia is doing? Malia? I don't want to tell Blackie to do something for someone I don't know. Fair enough, child. Then how about you think of it as doing a favor for me? Well, if it's a favor for you, old hag, I guess it's okay. That settles it, then. Sorry, Blackie, or whatever. We're counting on you.
welcome home, Malia. You're late. Hey, old hag! I really got into a crappy situation because of you! How are you gonna make it up to me, huh? You're hungry, aren't you? Let's all enjoy a meal together. <sighs> well, I guess my stomach was making some noise earlier. Hey, old hag! I heard something about a meal. I'm super hungry. After we eat, your stomach's growling will drown out any discussion we attempt. Ugh. If you insist, I'll eat. Yeah, all done. Thanks for the food. Now then, Molly. Leah find her way back to the swamp. Why do I gotta do it? I, I don't wanna go with her. This old hag's hip hurts, you see. I cannot make it all the way to the swamp. Ow! You two now have tummies full of warm food. So, Mafia, go with her. Man! You totally planned this! <laughs> now play nice and get going. Damn it! I... I'm gonna go home by myself! Oh, hey, wait! That dumb kid! Stop running off on your own! Wait, Malia! What? She's gonna get away! Taking her to the swamp. No need to get all dramatic. <laughs> That's true. Now go. Man, what's she talking about? wrong? Are you sleepy? That kid's not cute at all. I bet she has no friends. Well, I guess I'm the same way. Boys in the swamp. This is what a mom and dad. If I keep going in and out of here, eventually I'm gonna... Ugh, who cares? just going to her house and then leaving right away. Why do I gotta deal with this crap?
this brat could use magic. She should have told me. If that hit me, it would have been a serious blow. Stupid hag. Take care of Leah, my ass. My life was on the line. Should be fine if I disappear? I don't get what she meant. But I brought her home, so there. Now I gotta go home and complain. a mask. If you've been watching over her, there's something special about her, isn't there? Indeed, she is a special child. That girl needs the swamp to live. If she ever falls ill, make sure you have her drink some swamp water. S swamp water? Don't try to trick me. If anyone drinks that stuff, they'll die right away. Normal people? Yes. Please push your doubts aside and trust me on this one. Now then, let's focus on your training. Yeah, yeah.
you didn't eat the carrots. I'm going to tell the old hag to only make carrots from now on. What? You got a problem? I don't like carrots. Like I care. If the old hag knows you left food on your plate, she'll get super mad at you. But... Okay, fine. If you eat the carrots today, I won't say anything to her. Really? You won't tell her to only make carrots? Yeah, just eat today. Okay. Malia, 
Once you take my place as the Forest Witch, you will need to protect these lands. Do you understand? Watch over the forest surrounding the swamp and keep people away from that poisonous land. You think I'll just do whatever you say? Stupid old hag! I'm a genius witch! Once I take your place, I won't listen to what anyone tells me. If someone wants me to listen to them, they'll have to force me to. You included. How naive. Protective magic is certainly your natural talent. Oh! Yeah, like I said, I'm a genius witch. Know this, Malia. You will eventually have to tell Leah the truth. Tell her the truth? As if. Becoming a good witch will come naturally. What's that? A living will or something? <laughs> something like that. Hey! comes from mine. What? No way! It's true. The old hag told me. Listen, Malia sounds better and stronger than just Leah, right? Isn't it totally superior? of you. Heavens, you're the adult, so you shouldn't be making a scene over something trivial like your names. <laughs> Leah, snitches get stitches. Hey, old hag, I want a cooler name. Oh, I see. Like what? Um, super ultra hyper maximum. Your naming sense is garbage. I bet you're the type of person who'd name their dog Blackie because it has black fur. <laughs> no. -uh. Why are you getting all flustered then? Oh, jeez. 
Hi, hi. How about Natalia? Natalia. That sounds so cool. I love it. I see, I see. I'm glad to hear it. Maybe your simple old name suits you better. Quiet, you! I already decided. That's one of Leah's codes of conduct. You just called yourself Leah. Besides, that whole codes of conduct excerpt, you're using it wrong. Change her mind. There, I said it. Uh huh. Good job, Leah. Here's some chocolate as a reward. Wow! Everyone knows that Leah loves chocolate more than anything. Understand? 
Come to an end. I deeply regret that I was only able to teach you the very basics of what it means to be a witch. But you are talented and are able to empathize with others as you must have come to realize yourself. You will be a great witch unlike anything the world seen before. I can guarantee that. Well, assuming you refrain from taking too many violent actions. The house, books, and atelier tools, all of my things are now yours. Everything a witch needs is here. You should be just fine on your own. Protect these lands, forest witch. And one last thing. As your master, based on the witch's contract, I have one final command. Do must. I'm proud of you, my apprentice. It was really, truly fortunate that I met you. Thank you, Malia. Sincerely, lucky old hag. Our time came to an end? What's this stupid hat mean? Did you really die, you idiot? Selfishly disappearing like this. Some master. Don't be violent, huh? Don't screw with me. But fine, I understand. I'll take care of your stuff. After all, I don't have any other home to go back to. This is it. So I accept. I'll become the forest witch. You satisfied now? Huh? You stupid, dead old hag! That's right. I should let Leah know, too. is the forest witch. It's 
no joke. She's really gone. You probably can't meet up here anymore. she isn't hurt. When she falls like this, I have to... Right! Make her drink swamp water. But if I do that, will she leave me too? I, I guess I have to trust the old hag's words. What? The swamp's... gone? Swamp water. There has to be another swamp nearby. Do not concern yourself with Master Leah. I shall take care of her. Are you sure? Of course. That is why I exist. My current master is you, after all. I see. All right. I understand. 
I'll return to the old hag's... No, my master's house. Please take care of Leah. Yes, understood. There it is. Swap research. Hmm. Let's see. Noxious swamp originates from... Whoa. Is this for real? From... One time. And then when that one uses magic, the swamp decreases. Which means, if I get her to keep using magic, then one day, that dangerous and nauseating poisonous swamp can be completely erased from this world! And then nobody else will have to suffer because of its noxious gas! Feel better? So, why'd you come here? Wanna pick up where we left off? He's really gone? Like I said, we'll never see her again. She's here to apologize? She regrets her actions. She can be cute at times. But unless I get her to keep using her magic, poisonous swamp. No, if I do that, then. I'll give you something good, so we can forget that I called you a liar. Is that your way of apologizing? All right, what's this good thing? It's really good. My favorite food. Okay, close your eyes and open up. Fine. Like this?
swamp here before. As I thought, her magic causes it to go away. Either way, her magic power is stupidly high. Getting her to use magic is good. But if she used it in a populated area, it'd spell trouble. I should probably take that green crystal away from her. That way, she can't leave the swamp. Even if she calls my bluff, nobody else would have to suffer. I should probably destroy this. Welcome back, Master Moe. Sorry, the rest is in your hands now. Understood. Now that I think about it, this is the place the hag took me to. Start fresh and plant some new seeds. <laughs> Following me all this way, at least you have an adventurous spirit. Come, child. What? Finally gonna make me into your apprentice. That will always be up to you. Come, try planting seeds with me. Seeds? In this poisonous swamp? Consider it an experiment of sorts. Shut your mouth, cast magic on the seeds, and then plant them. Seed is that? How like the forest witch trying to grow trees in poisonous swamplands? <laughs> it's kind of funny, actually. Don't underestimate my magic. sprout faster than the others. I'm sure of it. <laughs> we shall see, child. That's why. That's why her name was Leah. What a stupid name. Far cry from growing any trees. The swamp's gone now, you old hag the swamp away and use her magic power to do it. The swamp should vanish in about a hundred years. Huh. I see how it is. At this pace, the swamp will vanish faster than expected. Take her with it. This should be dense swampland, but there's hardly anything here. You. What business do you have here? I am Valai, Amataya Kingdom's appointed witch. I came to meet you. The kingdom's appointed witch? Then you're basically witch royalty. What does her majesty need from me? I have a report from the kingdom. The council officially recognizes you as the new forest witch. <laughs> The kingdom? The old hag told everyone, didn't she? She could have let me know. Old hag? For an apprentice to speak of her master thusly. <sighs> well, no matter. Let us continue. I am the Sun Witch, who shines for a thousand miles. Valai Helson. I am the council head. Forest Witch Malia, I wish for you to become a true sage. Become a good witch, 
Lynch, who researches extensively in order to help make people's lives better. devote my life to becoming a worthy forest witch. I will hold you to that statement. Thank you. Farewell. <laughs> Farewell, huh? How humorous. I searched for ten long years, Master Uruka. But... Was that truly acceptable? Yes, we must return soon after all. Let us allow her to do the rest. For a praised clairvoyant like you to take ten years, the king must be absolutely furious. It is as you say. I've caused you quite a bit of trouble. I am grateful for your understanding. Gave me enough time to plant some seeds. Will the memory of this horrendous swamp finally disappear? We must pray that the karmic fate we forced upon ourselves can be changed. Two seeds. That. Holding on to. 
Did Hunter Knight bring something back from the other world? Let's see. I made long ago hundreds of them forgot how many of those things I make if you dig under the house I'm sure you could find a ton of them but wait you better not have been pissing away the time by rifling through this house's basement who said you could look around so useless enough of this crap Making me remember something so dumb. I'm not like that anymore. I'm different now. I know. I'm not going to tolerate anyone who selfishly vanishes without telling me. I've decided that I'm going to force that dog. I'll force Bisco to come back here. Excuse us. We are inquisitors working for the church. We arrived with orders from His Majesty the King. Is there a swamp witch here? I Inquisitors? Is this because of Mitten? Stay here. You think you've prepared countermeasures, do you? Damn. I thought I'd get to hear their final cries while they pissed their pants in fear. Oh. If it's boring, I'll just kill them where they stay. I'm the Swap Witch. What business do you have that demands my immediate attention? I've come to relay a message from His Majesty. He says the following. Swamp Witch, we wish to invite you to Amataya Kingdom to serve as our officially appointed witch. Huh? The kingdom's appointed witch?